Hey guys, you're watching Mixed Info videos and we'll see how to use combo box in Excel. So a combo box is a type of form control in Excel used for making interactive dashboards. All right. So we have uh, this uh, pivot table created from this master data. And in this master data, we have selected this uh, column, uh, the month column, the product category and this profit column. To create this pivot table here all right so in this pivot table we have a profit value displaying for each product category for respective months and then we have created this reference table with the month column and the profit column also we have created this uh, list with the product category right so to use a form control in excel this developer tab needs to be enabled if it is not enabled for you, you can go to File, Options, select Customize Ribbon, and select Developer from this list, and say OK. Right. So to insert a combo box, you go to Developer, Insert, and then select this uh, combo box and place it somewhere on this Excel. Let me just adjust it like this and then place it here. So now let us format this uh, combo box. So to do that, right click on it, go to format control. And then for this input range, select this product category list. And for the cell link value, select this M1 for now. Right, and then click on OK. All right, so now when I uh, select this drop down, you see the list of the product category here. So let us select accessories, and then you see this selling value is one, and then bikes, and then the selling value is changing to two. That is the position for this product category. All right, so now to display the profit value in this reference table. We'll use the offset function. So to use this offset function, we'll do equal to sign offset open parenthesis and then select uh, this month column that is A6 dollar sign dollar sign comma row open and close parenthesis minus six so this row open and close parenthesis minus six will return the current cell value for this month all right and then comma select this uh, cell link m1 dollar sign dollar sign and then close parenthesis for this function all right, so now we have the profit value for January month for this uh, bikes category. All right, so now let us copy and paste this formula to all the rows in this profit column. So now we have the data here. So if I change the product category to accessories, you have the profit value display for each month for this product category. So likewise, if I select clothing, it will display the data for this uh, product category also to make this uh, chart more presentable we can insert a column chart from here let me select this all right so now if i change the product category to accessories the value in this reference table as well as the chart is changing so likewise if i select uh, Another product category, it is uh, the value is changing in the reference table as well as uh, uh, this uh, chart. So, all right, so that is how you use uh, combo box in Excel. So, I hope this video was useful to you. Please like and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.